Hello and welcome back everybody. I'm going to show you how to manage processes in a Linux terminal. Alright, so let's say you started a process that blocks your terminal. For example, here's my text editor, Kate. I can use it, nice. But you'll notice my terminal is locked up. Now there's a way I could have prevented that. I'm going to use Control c to kill it. I killed Kate, it's gone. But uh, if, if I wanted to still be able to use this terminal, I, couldn't, I can type in the command and an ampersand. That says put this in the background on startup. So there it is. I still have shell access and Kate is running. I'm telling some file and I want to put this in the background, but I've already run the command. You can press Control Z, which will freeze or stop the program. Then BG will put that into the background. So yeah, I can type in commands and I have two jobs running in the background right now. If I type in foreground, it will foreground the last process, which basically just means it's in its broken state it was in just before I had pressed Control Z in the first place. So as if I were up here just having run tell. So tell is in the foreground. Still waiting for tell to exit. So Control Z and BG were back to two jobs in, in, in this shell. To see those jobs, we can run jobs. First job is Kate, second job is tell. We can kill those by typing in kill and then percent one for Kate and percent two for tell in this case. Referenced here, or if we want to foreground one of them, we can do so simply by going like this, or this, depending if you want Kate or tell. But here, we foreground Kate, we can control C to kill it, and that killed it. We can foreground again, that will foreground tell, and we can kill it, and job control. Thanks for watching.